Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae here with another Simply Gilded subscription box review. Um, I'm so excited to be here to show you this video today. Um, as promised, I literally just got the box in the mail this afternoon when I came home from work and decided to go ahead and get this film so that I can get it posted so that you see it a lot faster than you saw my last one. So anyway, if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for dropping by. And if you're returning, hey, thank you so much for being a part of this family. Um, please go ahead and before we get started, hit that notification bell, subscribe button, as well as the like button. Let's go ahead and get started. So this subscription box is called Folktale. I'm going to be honest with you. When I saw the picture of this one, I was like, mm, I don't really know about this one. I actually, okay, I'm just going to keep it real. I actually tried to cancel the subscription box because I wasn't really sure how I would feel about this one. Um, but unfortunately, I waited too late. And so they would not allow me to do that. Um, but hopefully, yeah, hopefully it's not that bad, but I guess we're going to find out. So anyway, this is the, I guess, October box. I never know what the difference is, um, but it's called Folktale. So I do like the colors. I'm just not sure how I feel about all the colors together <laughs> in such a way. Um, but let's see, maybe it'll surprise me. So as always, we have our, um, card that tells you what's in here. So there's a, a, a foiled journaling card, designer washi tapes, heart shaped sticky notes, deluxe quilted pouch, premium sticker sheets and seals, Sakura moonlight jelly roll pen, vellum and acetate mini sheets b6 dot grid blackout journal an engraved black gel, black gel ink pen and then there's a mystery item so yeah let's see y'all these colors these colors are really yeah it's a little it's a little much for me uh, it's a little much i don't know i mean i like the bag i like the size of the bag yeah, I don't, I don't know. I'm not really a quilted. I mean, not quilted. I'm not really a colorful type of planner. I try to stick kind of in more of the neutral tones. Um, and I'm not really big on all of the patterns either. But we'll see how the washi is. Now, that's kind of cute. It's like... It has some gold foiling and some little pink. I don't know if those are flowers or what's going on, but that's not bad. I don't mind this color. And then we have this. Oh, now this is gorgeous. <laughs> I love this like hot pink kind of color. That's really pretty. Um, Hopefully there's a big one. Yes, there it is. There's a big one to match the small one. Those are beautiful. And I don't have any other ones in that color. So those will be really great. And, oh yeah. Mm -mm. No, probably will not be using this one. Because um, it kind of matches the pattern on the bag a little bit. And honestly, I'm just not a fan. I'm, yeah. Mm -mm. <laughs> um, so I'm going to put these two in the, eh, I don't know, pile. Ooh. Uh. Yeah, so, um, yeah, so I'm going to also put this one in the pile. There's some like birds on here and some other flower-like things. Um, um, yeah, it's just not, it's just not my personal style. Um, but I'm not gonna, you know, yuck anyone else's. I always say yuck anyone else's yum. Uh, when it comes to food, but you know, I mean, this certain things for certain people. Um, these two, these three, just really aren't my particular cup of tea. So they will probably either show up somewhere in a giveaway, or maybe I'll just put them in my D stash pile. I'm not really sure. We'll see. 
So, but I did get these two colors and I'm very, 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 very happy with these because um, I have a couple of sprays that I'm sure will look beautiful with these colors. So anyway, one, two, three, four, you get five rolls of washi this time in this set, which is cool. Then in the bag, you also get this. This is the black and gold um, engraved pen. And this is gorgeous. I love all the little bow details on there. Um, yeah, this one's gorgeous. So this will go great in my little pin collection. I've given some of them away, which is why I don't have as many, um, but this will fit in there beautifully. And um, I also keep one of them in my Bible bag. So um, I'm sorry, in my wallet so that I can use it because it's really, really pretty. And then this one is the Jelly Roll pin. We got, an, I got a purple one back. I don't remember which um, box that was, but I did get a purple one back then. I haven't used it yet because I have so many pins, but one day it'll be a jelly roll kind of day, I'm sure. So that's really cute. I like the hot pink color, so I'm sure that'll be really pretty. And then it looks like, now this I like. I love the black heart um, and the gold foiling around it. I think that's very pretty. I assume that this little jelly roll pen will probably write on this black. So that'll be kind of cool. Hopefully the purple one will kind of show up as well. We'll see. And then here's the, mm, yeah. Here's the journaling card. Whew, follows that same kind of theme. Like I said, for me, it's just a little too extra. Like I'm, I'm just, I'm just not this extra, not in my planner anyway. Um, so yeah, that'll either go again in the D-stash pile or in um, some sort of giveaway or something along with this pouch. And for sure. <laughs> and at least these two ribbons, I'm not really sure about this one yet. The, the verdict's kind of still out on that one so and then here is the b6 notepad which yeah this this yeah it's a no-go for me as well i do want to open it though because it said because honestly even with the i may be able to cover it uh grab some scissors i may actually be able to cover the notebook and then i wouldn't have to look at the pattern so let's see what the inside looks like it might be worth oh it is black in there though that's kind of cool i don't have any black um oh yeah that's kind of cool okay so this might be worth keeping and just recovering the front so that i don't have to look at this pattern all the time but yeah that's kind of cool it's like a black with the white polka dot grid in there that's cool um and then this is oh is this the velvet? this is probably the vellum and acetate yeah, again. <laughs> this, I'm assuming, this is, oh yeah, this is definitely the vellum, which I'm assuming is kind of like this pattern here, maybe, from this ribbon, although this is black and this, this is blue. It just looks very similar to the pattern in this one. Um, so... I mean, it's okay. I like it. I don't love it, but I do like it a little, I guess. Not really sure what I would use it for, but it's cool. And then here is the acetate. Now, the acetate I really like. Um, I like just the gold foiling on there. I think that's really cute. So again, I don't I don't really either ever use either of these, but Kind of assuming that's what this is for. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't even know what this is for. <laughs> um, but I, I will find something to do with this because I think this is pretty. So there is that. And then let me get these scissors out the way. And then obviously here are whew, the stickers. Oh, man. Okay. So, 
yeah again it's very 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 bright i do love this one live love and laughed often that's cute even this one's not so bad the story of you written and illustrated by you that's cool these are okay um the headers and even the little icons they're not as bad individually i just don't know if i would ever actually use them in a spread because they're just like i said they're a little much for me um same thing with these i love um, the headers, I love the, um, I don't know, to-do list boxes, things like that. I even like this home is where the heart is. I think that's really cute. And the bunny and the, these are not bad either. I don't know. It's just a lot of rainbows, guys. <laughs> it's just a lot. It's a lot of rainbows. Um, and then these little blackout boxes, these are kind of cool. They're not as bright as the other ones, which I kind of like, even though it has the extra pictures on there. They're a little bit more matted, so that's kind of, I'm muted, sorry. So that's pretty cool. And then I love these little gold bowls over there. Those are really pretty. So that page is, has potential. These, mm -mm, no, probably will not use these. <laughs> Um, yes, way too much going on in these for me. Um, so anyway, there's that. And then I'm assuming that this is the mystery item is an enamel pin, um, which I actually really kind of like the bunny. I think it's cute in isolation. I have a few enamel pins that I've been collecting. So I think this will be really cute in, my collection and it of course has the little simply gilded bow up there which i think is so precious so yeah that's everything five washi rolls you got your little quilted bag your journaling card um two pins this blackout notebook which is really cool of course you get your three well four sheets of stickers technically and you get this time it came with the vellum sheet and then the acetate sheet and then you get your cool black grid b6 journal which i really like and then the enamel pin and um yeah that's everything that was in this box so thank you so much for tuning in today if you again like this video and you have not already done so be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever i post a new video thank you so much for watching and as always have a good day friends goodbye